we are lucky, we are here, we are inside this place. Oh no! <laughs> Beautiful! <laughs> Радиации нет. Так, это, так. это человек не досыпая, человек не досыпая. Ему кажется всякая радиация. Hola hermosa gente de Bielorrusia y el mundo. Mi nombre es Santiago. Soy argentino y estoy acá para hacer un poco de fotografía de viaje y buscando contenido especial para mi próximo blog. Por favor, quédense ahí porque van a ver algo espectacular. Hey, Esta es la noticia. Finally, a morning with sun, that's cool. Let's see if I can actually stop it. Maybe I should stop looking at the camera and actually start looking at the cars, because it might take a while. Коли шукаєш цікавий матеріал для блогу, мусиш іти шляхом, які інші побминули. Сантьяго хоче навідати білоруську зону, яка й утворилася після Чорнобильської катастрофи. А коли пригоду було більш, відмовився від нашої пропанови їхати разом. Що ж, Сантьяго, поспіхів? Добре, 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 добре. Я тут, в кінці нового. Basically, I was dropped in this petrol station on my way to the exclusion zone. I was hitchhiking and this is where I'm now. That's the perks or the cons, depends on how you look at it, from hitchhiking and backpacking and traveling. I saw this massive wheel. It looked kind of funny. Who knows where I am, but the only thing I know is that I'm going to get there somehow. Finally made it to Babrusk. The weather, it's getting a bit worse. It might rain, I hope not, I don't want to get wet. By the way, I excuse myself about the filming. This is a new camera, I'm testing it out. So I might be out of focus sometimes, but don't worry. You get enough time to see me in the next hours. If you need it, to have this Pangliski. Uh, beaver statue beaver failed mission number one let's see if I can find someone else that'll be able to help me a little shop Сапраудный подорожный блогер повинен легко знаходить мову с любым человеком, а на ваджиолою. Али у пошуках головного символа Бабруйску легко не будет. I think I just have to walk around and around. I didn't download the map. Stupid thing. Usually, you know, as a traveler, I should have done it, but I don't have it. Еще раз вот это что последнее? Не понимаю, не понимаю. Нет, я понял, что самое хочешь достопримечательности посадить какие-то, памятники там, архитектуры, да? Нет, no idea. But thank you. Спасибо. Хорошего дня. Удачи. Извините. Один момент. Минут, минут. Но. Бобр, бобер. Бобер, бобер. Бобер. Где? Где, где, где? Да. По-русски говоришь? Чуть-чуть. Я не понимаю. Let's go. На. Пешком прямо, пойдешь? прямо. Пешком пойдешь? Ну, no, ну, no, ну. No. Не прямо. Не прямо. Налево. Налево. Иди, 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 иди. Иди, иди, иди. Да, иди, иди. иди и дойдешь иди. как раз до бобра. Там рынок. Тебе пройти. One, two, three. Four, five. Четыре. Four, Четыре. Пять. Пять. Да, есть. Спасибо. Хорошего дня. Откуда вы? Аргентина. Из Аргентины. Месси. Месси, есть. Аргентина презенте. This is a strange looking mural slash advertisement. Even a bankomat in a weird placed situation. Yeah. But yeah, I think that's another thing that you might see sometimes in Belarus. Random stuff just placed anywhere. 
<laughs> Pretty cool anyway. I wouldn't have expected that of a former Soviet country before coming here, but as everything in Belarus, a big surprise. <laughs> yeah, I don't really think it's this one. If this, if this is it, I don't know what I'm doing here. Just wasting my time. Mr. Beaver, Kagdila. Putting some life in this place. Hello. 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 So, I was so focused on the people and walking around, talking, and I missed what I came here looking for. There is the famous beaver. If you were considering coming to Europe, definitely put Belarus on your agenda, definitely. Means it's unreal, and even these little towns, there's things to do, people to admire, they will be friendly with you. Don't expect good weather though, it's kind of terrible actually. Still, I think I'm in love with this place. I ran out. I'm just outside the hotel now. Just about to start my day and the trip to the exclusion zone. This is good. Finally, I'm going there. Good times. Just take a look at the logo. All these nice animals on the top and the fauna and flora and this radio radioactive side. It's a bit scary. I think here's my guy for today. Strasbourg here. Hello, how are you? Thank you, I am fine. Are you a scientist? Yes. I am the head of the laboratory of uh, spectrometry and radiochemistry. Wow. So the uh, main task of our laboratory is to determine the concentration of radionuclides in the samples of in environmental samples. There is not a lot of tourists in our zone like because uh, we only we do it only one year. Wow. So we'll are at the beginning yeah. of organization. Is it, is it safe? Yes. Yes. It's, it's uh, not more dangerous than air trip. It's uh, one example and this is a one more. Does it say that you don't take blame if I die out of radiation? <laughs> just kidding, just kidding. So the uh, main instructions about your coming in exclusion zone yes, are yes. simple. You shouldn't uh, take something which is growing inside and drink it okay. or eat and uh, don't take anything inside exclusion zone with you to take it out. What about my clothes? <laughs> what's up, what's up, what's up? Thank you, Slava. A cool guy. Good, I'm happy now. I thought you wouldn't speak English, so I would struggle, but yeah, it's very good. And one more thing, nothing to do with this. You are born? I'm very curious, yeah, that's, that's a thing. To me, routine doesn't make it. Цікавно, аргентинец вандрує больш 10 годів і в Європі, до прикладу, наведав усі країни, окрім трьох. Він уже був у зоні відселення з українського боку, але коли доведався, що для туристу відкрили білоруську частку, захотів дослідувати її. Before coming here, I had this image of a really Soviet country, and when I arrived, it was much more open-minded and westernized in many aspects. So, I'm sorry, now 
we are coming to the plant. The, um, this plant was produced food for animals. Slava, can I just walk around? Yeah. Yes. Awesome. Should I walk on the path or can I walk everywhere? Everywhere, no problem. This is nice. This is not like Ukraine. Here you can do whatever you want. I hope that's a good thing. Can you use it actually afterwards in the for farming? Yes. Those, these things. Yes. Is it not radioactive? It doesn't keep any radiation or. Even in the case if it's radioactive, uh, it can be used for eating animals inside this zone, but not, not, outside. not outside. And do, do they check, for example, in the Gomel area, do they check, for example, the cows and the milk and everything for radiation before selling or not really? I do you know? So. Yeah, I think, think so, yeah. Should be checked. yeah. Whoa, this is cool and sad at the same time but have to be careful when walking around here with a camera because a few holes if there's one thing i don't want to do is die in a radioactive belarusian area wow this will collapse anytime i wouldn't say this is very safe to visit we can also check the beta contamination you see this is for detector for beta particles. For beta particles, yeah. For strontium, you see, it's clean. It's clean, yeah. Yes. So why why did it take so long to open this area for tourism? Then, if it's clean, <laughs> but it's clean here, but outside it's, it's, it's not, it's not clean. Yeah. Lava. Yes. Is it possible to swim? The water is clean here, but I'm not sure about that uh, deposition and the temperature is not very high now. The water moves. Would you say that some of the radiation still goes on to the cities? Down the river or, or what do you think? The water which is Dote rivers, which is coming from exclusion zone inside the river, yeah. they are more contaminated. More contaminated, okay. And uh, have more cesium-137 and strontium-90. Okay. I will take the samples and take it to our laboratory to and we, we measure. They are not ready for eating. They are I, green. I wouldn't eat it anyway. Would you eat this? <laughs> no problem? I think... Try, try the... If, you, you have the oscillator. Yes, Maybe we can if, try... If I... Mm, Take one, it will be no, no danger for me. This guy is brave, man. It seems like the only one that is thriving in this area is nature. Humans, but for no them, humans. for them is perfect. But in even in, you know, in Ukrainian side. You have some areas where their people never left. They still s stayed in their villages because they didn't want to leave what they had. Uh, and there are, some of them are still alive, 80, 90 years. Do you have any people like that here living? No, no, no it's prohibited. It's no, no people no. inside. Exclusion. No people whatsoever. Wow. Коли мы рыхтовались до вандровки с Сантьяго, шмат кто нам раю узнать дивака, который один застался жить у отселенной вёсцы Пикулиха, что по за зоны отчужения. Мы отшукали легендарного Мишу Самбрера, але не смогли подлумачить иншаземцу светопогляд Робинзона. Бошир, окажуши, сами не усё заразумели. Здравствуйте. Миша. Можно, можно фото? 
А, так... А... Место жилое, стихия не угрожая. Вы Пис... уже здесь прожили? Да, с 50 -го года. Батьки я не, ра... не знаю, ни разу не бачил, кто им такой. Может, и на... на космической базе, а может, Хунтамас, мой батька. А почему они уехали, когда всю деревню отселили? А они, у меня свое соображение, я такой пустотой не занимаюсь. Куда-то в жило... жилое место можно ехать. Сто человек жило, радиация. Да. А, а одна брахня брахня, а другая подхватывает брахню. И вот так разум рассыпается. Я просто увлекаюсь ради разума. Я сам, я так ради, по ради разуму все понимаю, но я не знаю, как схему ромонтировать. Я, я не пью. Рассольчик самый лучший, помидорный. Вот это я первый раз вижу. Так да тоже неизвестный спутник, да? Не, не укурсить тело? Это земная камера или оттуда где слышно? Греется. Греется? Греется. Надо, чтобы не грелось. Раньше тут паромная переправа. There we go. Beautiful rain. Can we try measuring the ship over here? Yeah. It's not very high, but at the same time we could say that there is better contamination. This abandoned ship is one of the most inspiring, if that's the right word to use here. It's, it's pretty incredible. Slava, sorry. Can you help me translate these things? What is it exactly that it says here? Uh, the wo Workers' Day, day. Yeah. yes. International Workers' Day. Which is one of the biggest celebrations here, right? And this actually happened like the 26th of April, like the Chernobyl. Do you know when they left this town? Approximately one month after the accident. And we, one month. We can check. So probably the village was actually abandoned after the celebrations of the 1st of May. It's wow. Just take a look at this. it from all the kids that were once starting here like I wonder what they're doing these days if they are involved in what happened here nothing to do to house their health if they are still alive or maybe not it would be interesting to maybe meet some of them This school is such an incredible sight. Most shocking, I would say, buildings I've seen in the area. If you've seen just the way in, probably if you don't know that there's a school here, there's no way you will find it because the nature overtook all of it. Even the houses, you can see them a bit, but they are almost gone, all of them. There are some huge lightnings here. I was considering going up the tower, but I guess I won't. I don't want to be carbonized in a little village in the exclusion zone. It's kind of heartbreaking.
Yeah, I had nothing to say finally. But it's, I'm very fortunate to be here, to be able to see it by myself. Whoa. And again, nature was at its best. It's just unbelievable to see this. I think that everyone should come and check this out. See for themselves. It's an incredibly interesting place to, to visit. I think we have a lot to learn as human beings only of also of this area. On the one side, how we treat nature. Here, everything but us is thriving. And on the other hand, what we are doing as, as a species, like, why are we still playing with things like nuclear power, but it seems that we never learn. До побачення, Сантьяго. Годний буде контент. Сподіваємося, твоя обаяльна усмішка, стильова борода і цікавий розум не збирають шмат подобаєк.